Hey lip bugs, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ashley for tuning in for the first time and today I left my hair out. This is a U part wig and I am wearing my own leave out. And the best part about this, no heat damage. So I shampoo and conditioned my hair about two days ago and I decided to go ahead and let it air dry. I left out a little bit of leave out and then I decided to install this cute little U part wig, but I did not want to straighten my hair for one when my hair is press it does not match a uh, kinky texture as much um, and then also I just wanted to really just again not use any heat at all so I was able to achieve this style with no heat no product at all it literally is my natural hair in a ponytail and I did do a little bit of baby hair not too much but you guys know the forehead before head and so I had to do a little something so if you're interested in seeing how I installed this this wig how I did it with no heat and how I got my natural hair to blend keep on watching jumping right into it this is my hair straight out of the shower I believe I washed conditioned on this day and detangled and this is what my hair looks like I'm honestly in serious need of some TLC when it comes to my natural hair it definitely 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 has been neglected over the last few years it broke off so bad and shed so bad during COVID um, and plus you know postpartum hair loss three times and so I really really just need to focus on getting my hair back Back to a comfortable state but I just kind of wanted to show you a vulnerable moment of my hair in its natural state this is two days before I filmed the video and then fast forward to now we're gonna actually do the install um, here I am showing you the wig straight out of the box Eunice hair definitely has some superior packaging and this is the wig itself we are doing a kinky straight U part wig install so I did want to slow it down and make sure you guys seen a really really good good close-up of what the wig looks like it comes just like this there are a few bins that you can typically use a flat iron or a blow dryer to get out here I'm showing you the parting leave out again I wash and condition two days before so the hair has been my hair has been just air drying as you guys can see I'm in need of a good cut and just a fresh start so I went ahead and reparted the hair I had parted the hair in a V part style two days before and I completely forgot I'm so used to doing V parts that I accidentally parted for a V part and then I went back in on this day and parted for a U part and rebraided the rest of the hair now we are cutting off those little strips or tabs that kind of keep the wig together those are meant to be cut off they typically just make it like that so the wig you know has a nice formation if you want to put it like on a wig um, wig head or something like that but now that we're ready to install I went ahead and just cut those little two pieces off and begin the install process now today I did something a little bit different by leaving a little bit of my edges out now my edges are not full by any means so it doesn't cover a whole lot but again it just gives the illusion of you know a more natural install here I'm showing you what it looks like so you can't see any tracks or anything like that. And we're going to try something different. As you guys can see, my leave out was a little bit damaged when it was wet and it is in definite need of a haircut. So I did not want to manipulate it by adding more heat. So I'm showing you a heatless way to install a U part and have it look really good. And honestly, this made the wig feel even more secure. I'm just gathering up all of the leave out that I chose and just pulling up enough hair to cover um, the tracks around but also to go into the ponytail so that it's nice and full and then I just secured it with a outless um, scrunchie and we are pretty much uh, styled so to add a little bit of finesse I'm going to go ahead and use my edge control from bdacbeauty.com I like to go ahead and use the back of an edge brush to kind of just apply it to the hair so that I'm not using my long nails and getting that product underneath my nails and now I'm just going to go in and swoop some baby hair because my hair is not trained by any means my baby hair is not the best it could be something I definitely need to work on nonetheless I really really do love the install and how it came out very natural and zero heat Okay, love bugs. So we are done with this look. I challenged myself to a half up, half down, and I honestly wasn't 
sure that I can execute it and I actually did and I actually love it. Now, I can't take all the credit for this. They actually hit me up um, a couple of days ago and were like, um, they pulled up an old picture of me where I had like the same texture of hair, half a pap down and they were like, can you do this look for the video? And I was a little bit nervous because every time I've ever done this look, I've done it with a lace front, a lace closure, something. I've never done it with a U-part wig. You know, so in my mind, I'm like, you know, my hair is too thin. I won't be able to pull it off. But also having this U part, I do want to start putting less heat on my leave out because it is giving a little bit heat damaged. So I was like, you know what? That would be the perfect thing to be able to rock my U part wig without having to put any heat. And I delivered. So before I show you the wig in more detail, this is the packaging. You guys already seen the dust bag. It's over yonder. So the box opens on the side like so. And inside you do have a little goodie bag. Beyond the goodie bag, you do have a hair clip. And it just reads Eunice, really nice. And they actually gave two of those. So that's super nice. And then they also gave me um, a pair of gold hoops. I think it's two in there. I don't know if it's two pair or if it's one and it's doubled. I think it's one and it's doubled. But super cute little gold hoops. And then also this goodie bag here. And inside you get the usual suspects. You get your wig caps. You get your wig band. You get a kabuki brush. And then you also get some nice thick lashes. I wish I would have opened up the package and grabbed these out. Because I'm wearing something from bdacity.com. But I honestly wanted to save these for the weekend. I didn't want to um, wear these today. And all my other stash are um, off site. So uh, I, didn't, I, had, I had a choice. But that's neither here nor there. So the package says that this one is about 24 inches in length and it definitely is true to length. I'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like from the back. This one is gorgeous. Off the bat from installing it, um, I was definitely nervous about putting it up into a ponytail. Majority of the ponytail is my hair, but I did add, of course, some hair from the front of the wig for length so it can blend. I really just wanted to focus on not putting any heat in it, not putting any, you know, anything that was going to manipulate my hair. I can say that I probably... Um, We'll take it out and just put more hair. So like when you see these short pieces, it'll be more hair around the shorter pieces. But I think it blends very well. You guys know I got a five head. So I did go ahead and pull hair out from the front. Now I could definitely go in with the hair fibers and make it look a lot more full. I probably will do that before I take pictures because you guys know my hair is thin and I don't want... Um, to get that five this side is a little bit more full so i just want to make sure it looks nice and pretty i told you guys before i've contemplated hairline surgery which i don't think i would do i think that this old age of mine i'm gonna just stick with what god bless me would take my hair vitamins grease my scalp and call it a day um let me speak up on my hair fibers so as of now, I have two options. I have this here, which you can find like um, on the end cap little owls or like the hair dye owls at Target. And it's a root cover up um, and it covers temporary grays. It's a color dark brown and it does have that little spray nozzle. And if you spray it, it's wet. I don't know if you can see it there, but it just will like literally cover the grays and it's more of a obviously a liquid. This here is the hair fibers, and I bought this extra little attachment piece that gives it like this. Otherwise, it comes like a salt and pepper. Well, I got rid of the other part, but it comes like a, like a salt and pepper shaker, so you can just tip it upside down and shake. But this makes it so that you can like spray, and it kind of like missed out. So let's see if this will make a difference right here, because right here we do have some thinning it 
And so I'm just going to leave it as is. And it just gives the illusion that the hair is a lot more full. You can like slick your edges and do your baby hair and then put it on top. And when you have product on your hair or if your hair is straight, it'll give a different illusion. But it just attaches to the hair and makes the hair look a lot more full. I actually am feeling this look. I have Pilates in the morning and I think I might rock it. Well, for Pilates, I would definitely have to take this and like put it up. But I think I might rock it. I like it. I love it. And even more importantly, it feels stable. The wig itself fits my head perfectly. You could kind of see when I was putting it on that it wasn't baggy or loose. It literally fit to my head perfectly. And then also adding the ponytail up top kind of like holds it in place. A plus with the comb in the back so that it's not going anywhere at all. Now, of course, if I, somebody wanted to literally like destroy me and snatch it it can come off but as far as like just naturally falling off or sliding or like my kids being able to accidentally do anything not happening here it's definitely secured so go ahead and check out Eunice if you are looking for a u-part wig especially if you have like a full hairline where you're able to like have your leave out in the front and it can all go up this is a perfect wig where you can wear your hair blown out you don't have to straighten it or anything like that and you can always have a look even when you wear it down you always have a look so i'm here for the vibe i hope you guys are too if so check out the description box on your way out i'll have links to the hair fibers and stuff that i used in this video so that you guys can check that out as well it does come in a couple different colors both of them do also while you're there go ahead and subscribe thank you guys so much for watching and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches